Previously on Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. I do not pray to the goddesses, but to her mother, my dearest friend. How I miss her. Oh, that was the cutest goddamn thing ever. You are to tell no one about this, you all right? No one! One must not look at me as strong and diesel lady! And potential wafu lady! No! No wafu! Just diesel! And now back to saving hi- Ooh, what's that over there? Sneak B, back with some more Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. We last left off, we completed Rivali's and Daruk's side of the Champion's Ballad, and uh, now I've got their uh, plus abilities, leaving only Mifas, and also checking out uh, Daruk's diary. You know, I find it a little strange that uh, a lot of this characterization that goes for the, the champions is sort of locked under DLC. I mean, I, I saw some people argue for it, like, well, it isn't really necessary. That's true. I mean, it isn't like stuff that is like main plot important, but I feel like uh, overall the the champions that didn't get like a ton of characterization in the main story, um, and I feel like it was just it would have been something that would be kind of nice to have uh, in the base game. I think as well. Um, that said, uh, I'm really enjoying the DLC. I think it's great. Um, anyway, I, I saw a few guys were a little uh, got a little pissed off at my. <laughs> Uh, when I was talking about uh, Rivali and uh, reading his diary, uh, I, I'm sorry. I don't misunderstand. I, I'm actually not um, like saying I think Rivali, like I hate Rivali. I, I think he's a shit character or anything. No, I, I uh, actually, it's true. His his diary really did actually help to flesh him out quite a bit, um, which is another reason why I feel like this DLC would have been kind of nice because beforehand I did think it was just kind of a douchebag, but in the diary really revealed he, he like as you. As one of you had mentioned, he has he has a serious inferiority complex, um, and he and it shows that also he's incredibly committed to making himself a better person. He works really hard after putting that time in and getting that recognition and stuff, and then having Link come by and make him feel inferior again. He feels he needs to challenge him. You know, it it's part of his character and it adds a lot more depth to him. For me, I, I always have a lot of fun with the douchey characters, you know? I mean, look at Tagami, look at Joshua. I, I just have a lot of fun with them. But don't take it as me hating on the character or saying they're like bad or something. Uh, it, that isn't the case. No, I, I just like voicing them and, oh, hey, it's a quest there. And, <laughs> Holy hotness! <laughs> Why am I sleeping here? <laughs> Actually, I just think about that. I have to sleep in this armor in order not to catch fire. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be comfy. Uh, hey, lady. Romella. Savota. Oh, sir, I never got a chance to talk to you. You're always asleep at the end. But only to flirt, isn't it? <laughs> that's not what I... <laughs> oh, that's too bad. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Romella. As you can see, I'm from the Gerudo region. I came for the jewels that are to be found in Goron City. The eruptions on Death, Death Mountain finally come to a stop. As a result, we started restocking jewels. Mm -hmm. Oh, do you have some amber too? I need a whole lot of it. Mm -hmm. Any tavern, I'll buy them for you more than a shop would pay. Oh! Oh, the jewel trade. Okay, cool. Uh, I think I probably have some. I'm really so. Oh, yeah. I got plenty. Here you go, lady. Uh, well, power alone is not going to save me from this heat. Because they have 10 pieces of amber, so you sell them to me. Sell them for the, to the sh shop, you'll get 300. I'll sell them to me, I'll get 500. Fuck yeah! Take my amber, baby. Sock so, it's a huge help. Thanks, here you go, 500 rupees. Cool. You can procure other jewels too, so keep bringing me what you find. Bring me ten at a time, got it? As for what kinds of jewels I want to buy, well, that's likely to change every once in a while. Oh. Oh, interesting. Okay. Ten rubies. Oh, whoa, okay. Oh, so instead of 2100, you'll give me 2300. Sure. Sucks so. It's a huge help. Here, take this. Oh, my God. Make it bank. Step ten rubies, I'll buy them for 300. Do I still have 10 rubies? I don't. Wait, wait, wait what was it? I, I, don't, I don't even know. Whatever, take them. I got, I got tons of them. Oh, topazes. So she just like keeps changing it to something else? 10 diamonds. Oh! Do I have that many? Oh my god, I do have 10 diamonds! Okay, that's, I, I, that's plenty, lady. I, oh my god. Wow! Sweet! I think I actually had exactly 10 diamonds. Yeah. <laughs> They're just taking up space in my inventory. Wow, okay, I'm making bank now. Mmm. You know what, though? Uh, I feel a little unsure whether selling all of my diamonds is a good idea right this moment. I don't know. I mean, I actually think I'm gonna, I'm gonna reload that. If I had one diamond left, okay, but there might be, I, I feel like there could be some side quests later on. It's like, I need a diamond, I'm be, then I'm gonna be like, oh shit. Oh yeah, I never actually stayed the night at this inn before. 
Let's try their their thing. We know how to stop stirring up trouble. The man bonds to stop too. Of course, I don't go outside, so it makes no difference to me. Oh. And here, tie it back to business. Uh, I want to go on a massage, baby. Oh yeah, give me a massage. Oh, actually, a massage. Here, the art of go on massage. I take it. That's okay. We're time for everything, as they say. Is that what the other lady at uh, Grudo gave me too? Oh no, that was like a spa, but it's just like she like rubbed me down. We're on style massage, stunned on top of a rock hard bed. Pressure is applied to your body to squeeze the tension out of you like a tube of toothpaste. Ew, what ew? But I tell you, it doesn't hurt one bit, mostly. I say it does off sometimes. <laughs> What's all over, you feel like a rock. A rock can feel great when you wake up. You'll be all limber and full of energy. All right, well, let's, let's do it, man. Hmm. Oh, you want me? Okay, I'll do it till morning. Go oh, ahead, lay down the rap bed. Loosen up those tiny muscles. Hey, Vulcan! Got a customer. Oh, it's... <laughs> Got your cover, buddy! <laughs> Ow! Oh, God, no, it just hurts. It just hurts. Fuck. Oh. Still got 10 parts, though. And stamina. Morning. How's was the massage, man, right? Take care, brother. Got pretty sensual that last night, didn't it? So you'll call me, right? Uh, uh, I gotta go. Yeah, get back. I didn't get your number. Oh, by the way, uh, a quick update again on the Council of Voices. Uh, I managed to fit a, finish a bit more. I, fit, I went from one minute finish to, get ready, four minutes finished. <laughs> yeah. I know you're probably like, are you fucking kidding me, Nico? Trust me. I, 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 I actually, I ended up... <laughs> I put like eight hours into that fucking three minutes that I got added to it. I know it seems ridiculous, but a lot happens in the first few minutes of it, okay? The good news is that uh, not all parts of it are uh, gonna take that long. So, like, there are parts where certain things happen and it, I'll be able to get big chunks of it done at that time. Uh, that first few minutes, though, is just a lot of stuff happens, alright? You'll see, alright? It'll make sense when you fucking see it! There might be a point where if I do end up finishing this game before I have gotten the Council Voices done, I might just take a small break from posting anything just to fully commit and get it done as quickly as possible. And then we'll jump back into the regular two video series at the same time stuff. Also, one last thing to note, uh, Yoshi, our resident Peaky Penguin plushie maker, uh, just recently released a uh, redone uh, Apollo and Phoenix Wright, and they look so good. Here's what they looked like initially when we first did it. Simple, but but very cute. Now look at the redone ones. When I saw these, I was like, whoa, oh my God, it just blew me away. It really shows us how like, how far she's come to, you know? You see a real like evolution to Yoshi's work um, over time. She's just gotten so good at like really nailing each character's aesthetic. Look at that hair. It's so gorgeous. See, she even got the tiny little suits on them. I'm really proud of her. I think she's just been doing an amazing job with these plushies. And again, thank you guys so much for the support you've shown both her and myself in this endeavor. It's been a lot of fun coming up with new ideas and uh, hearing from you guys. And I know Yoshi's really been enjoying it as well. Um, anyway, they're available in the store if you want to check out the redone ones. And also, same as before, we still got the uh, Link, Zelda, and Mifa, as well as the uh, Korok mask accessory as well, still available. It's still early in the day, but it's already hot out. Yeah, you need something? Dump out, Daruk, Daruk. I knew something about Daruk. Huh, popular subject these days. Not too long ago, Rita Bar came by wanting to know all about him. To all about all kinds of things. For example, uh, oh, Cass, yeah. About that boulder breaker, Daruk's weapon of choice. To how heavy it is. Now its power is unmatched. God, God damn it, it Pluto, that's, that's not, not talking, talking about, about me, me alright? Right? Talking about my weapon, weapon isn't talking about me. This is what I'm talking about. This guy didn't really know me, alright? We barely, barely talked. talked. He just, just borrowed, borrowed more, more fucking, fucking money from me. me. Was it 20 rupees? Yes, yes it, was it was 20 rupees! rupees. You know the valley of Got Room Cliff, southwest of Gorko Tunnel. So me by Daruk. Let's boulder break her one night. Why? <laughs> Why? How do you think? Take it easier for us, Goros, get all that tasty rock roast. Hey, you know, fella, it seemed like, yeah, it felt like the other story. I told him better, though. <laughs> Not a big fan of that one. Her look at exciting stories of the capture much better. <laughs> but having a fear of dumb dogs. So else he needed. <laughs> I don't think he'd be too happy then to beat Bernie. Okay. Wait, wait, well, uh... 
Does he have a diary somewhere? Maybe Yenobos knows something. Hey, where is Yenobo anyway? Nova, so I'm staring off into the distance on top of the entrance gate. Typical. And it seems to me that Yenobo's acting more confident and confident these days. And he's finally realized what it means to be in the center of the correct route. Hey, man. Huh. Hey! Boss says back's all better, Goro. Oh, we're done. It's tough rampaging. I feel like if I'll take it easy, Goro. Oh, do you need something, Goro? Tell me about Daruk. Mm. Put Lord Daruk, Goro? Oh, oh I'm rising you something. I found Lord Daruk's training journal. Oh, great. <sighs> Still been a big eater. Sure talks about delicious rocks a bunch. W what else? Oh, oh, Lord Daruk also had a good friend who liked to eat as much as he did. I don't have much of an appetite myself, so I'm pretty scrawny, Goro. I'm gonna have to start eating lots so I can become strong as those two. Is it is it referring to me? <laughs> I think it might probably refer to me. I do like to eat stuff. Train journal. Oh. That's right. I found out when I was cleaning out the abandoned north north mine where we we met. Well, train train journal is at my house now, Goro. Mm. Oh, okay, great. Oh, right. I gotta remember to go complete that one quest too, because I I did defeat that uh, igneous talus. Oh, there it is. <laughs> and of course, it's made out of rock. Daruk's training journal. Is there if I read this, Daruk? Have at it, man. man. You're, my You're my little buddy. buddy. I ain't got, I ain't got nothing, nothing embarrassing, embarrassing in there. there. So maybe, maybe my fear, my fear of, dogs, of dogs, but I think you know well enough, enough about, about that. that. I'm start writing in this diary th thing starting now. Ugh, diary. I'll call it my train journal. Yeah, that sounds manly, manly enough. They say all you got to do is write down stuff that happens. I score on prefer the simple life. So I hope simple stuff counts. <laughs> Let's see. What kind of rock did I have today? Oh, man, that one rock by the fucking lava was really good. And 300 pages later. And then this rock did this, and this one did that, and... Yeah, uh-huh. Oh, man. Uh, uh, sorry. Link, go all sleep. We're gonna do a good part here. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Sleep, today's journey journal. What should I write about? Oh, I know. That's a rock rush for the, <laughs> the big of Death Mountain. It was delicious. I'll get more of it soon. We talked some highlands at the base of the mountain. All anyone wants to talk about these days is Calamity Ganon. I was when those tiny Sheikah came to Death Mountain a few years ago to dig up that divine beast or whatever. The highlands were saying that beast thing is a weapon, so we'll need to learn how to control. Back in the good old days, Gorons didn't worry about relics we couldn't eat. Mm. Now I'm hungry. I need more rock roast. I'll track down a prime rock roast for one of my dinners tonight. Today I saw someone being attacked when I was looking out for... was out looking for lunch rocks at the peak. He was a tiny little guy, so I rushed down the mountain to help him. I was shocked to find he was handy with a sword. Eh! <laughs> By the time I rolled his way, he'd already taken out all the monsters. Couldn't help but admire his Goron-like strength. Damn right, man. I was distracted. Monster almost got the jump on me. He stopped it. Great to root. Say back, tiny Hylian. Must have had a dopey look on my face when that happened. Hope he didn't notice. Ah, <laughs> uh, I like to root. He's cool. That old Hylian from before is named Link. He's got a respectable appetite. Loves to eat meat, fruit, vegetables, all sorts of things a decent person wouldn't dream of eating. Link will cook up and eat just about anything. Offered him some grade A rock roast to help refine his, his palate. Asked him how to taste it. He liked it so much he was speechless. <laughs> <laughs> oh my teeth! Ah, ah. I think I got a dentist out. New Hylian's gonna eat rocks too! Just gotta try! Fuck pussies! Oh, that magma is really burning my mouth. It's oh, it burning through my mouth. Eating is the only thing Link and I have in common. Luke guy is also incredibly strong. He says sometimes when he focuses, it feels like time slows down. <laughs> I really like that guy. Yeah, but it only happens when I leap off a rock or something. Like the Matrix! I love those movies! And he loves them too! Another thing we have in common! He's the type of guy you can trust to have your back, and also have a nice hearty meal with. Yeah, that sells it. From now on, Link is an official brother. <laughs> ah, so cute. Hyrule's little princess came to Goron City and asked me to follow the Divine Beast. I said yes. Great Daruk never turns down someone in need. When I said I would, would, the princess seemed really happy. But before champions to control four Divine Beasts, and one swordsman to take on Ganon, including the princess. Our anti-Ganon team is six strong, and of all different kinds of people. Says the makings of an epic feast. I got the ball rolling by giving the princess my best rock roast. She said thanks, but I think she was holding back a grimace. Must have had something foul in her mind. <laughs> I'm a champion now. Feels good. I hadn't talked with Link in a while, so seeing him as the, at the inauguration ceremony was nice. It was a good day. Oh! Word has it, Link has been chosen as Lelda's appointed knight. Can't think of a better brother for the job. That's cool. So we, we really actually knew each other for a good while. What was I doing out here, I wonder, for the first time? I hear one of those ancient machine things went nuts during some test and shot out deadly beams. With true Goron's spirit, Link grabbed a pot lid from the ground and deflected the blast. Boom! 
He nailed the thing in his weak spot and saved the day. Yeah, I still do it, man. Every time. Most of the time. His bravery caught the king's eye. Not long after that, he was appointed a guard Zelda. Expect nothing less from the little guy. Ah, uh, I see. Okay. Interesting. I didn't got much word about what I was like before I was even like appointed a royal guard. So it sounds, so it sounds like, well, no, no, I've known Mifa for a long time too. I was about to say, I've known him longer. Yes, yes don't, don't forget, forget about, about me, you know, your fishy wapo. Which is actually, I'm actually looking forward to that because I've, that's another kind of reason why I want to say Mifa for last because I think that's probably going to be the cutest one. I've been chosen to pilot Rodania, but I was having trouble controlling it. I was the only champion who was struggling. I asked Link for advice, but he just shoved me into the Divine Beast so I could explore it aimlessly all day. Can't explain it, but by the end of the day, I was able to control Rodania just how I wanted to. Because his experience is the best teacher. The little guy's strength must have come from working hard, never giving up. Good lesson, brother. That's yes, thanks, I'm gonna treat him to some gourmet sirloin rock. Oh man, I remember that rock? Yeah, yeah that, was that was some good, good stuff, stuff, wasn't it? it? Yeah, oh man, I need some serious new dentures after that. Yeah, yeah, that's how, that's you, how know you know it's good. good! All my Eileen brothers seems to do these days is watch over the tiny princess while she does her research. Looks like tough work, but the princess seems a lot happier. Talks more since she's been doing it, so it must be okay. And I don't know, she keeps looking at Link this weird way. I, I don't know what it is. It's probably some weird Hylian thing. I'm gonna fuck that boy one day. <laughs> she keeps looking at his behind. I, I, I don't understand it. Does he have a good rock roast down there? Heard a little guy finally opened up and about his troubles to the princess while they were shoveling food. Surprisingly, she opened up right back. Says something princessy like, I guess we're the same, you and I. Huh. Sounds heavy. Heavy rocks! <laughs> they must have been bonding over that f their food preferences. That'll do it, alright. Speaking of opening up, all this general writing has made me realize something about myself. Riding makes me hungry! Aw. <laughs> uh, I really like this. I really like these these sections, you know? I don't know. They're Daruk's really cool. I, I'm glad they fleshed out a lot of these characters. All of them. Is really helped. Oh, I'm looking forward to Mifa. That's gonna be good. I feel like it's giving some good shit. Ah. Link and Mifa have known each other since they were kids, right? Oh man, I can't wait to read her diary. It's gonna be so good. We know it's. No, no don't, don't read, read my, my diary, diary where I confess all about how much I love Link and how many babies I want to make with him. Girls, enough of the fall play, all right? Let's get into it. Stop trying to sell me. I'm already convinced. Oh, real quick, you guys told me something really neat. I really, I want to try. First, I gotta find. I gotta. I need to find one of those uh, sucky enemies real quick. Okay, you guys said apparently if I, if I drop like a rusted thing. Did he? Oh, there he goes. Where'd it go? Oh my god. How far did he throw it? Did he shoot it? But said it would clean it. No, where'd it go? Fuck, he might have shot it all the way in the lava. Man, he shot that far. Yeah, there we go. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, that's cool. That is pretty nifty, I gotta say. There's so much stuff in this game that I feel like so many people could easily miss, you know? Well, I probably, I never would have known that unless you guys had told me about it. Okay, there's, let's go talk to that one Goron. Oh wait, no it wasn't. Wow, that was a strange coincidence. <laughs> it was actually Darunia Lake, not Dar Pond. I thought it was a strange coincidence though that there was still an Igneous Talus at Dar Pond, but not the one that I was supposed to get. You know what, let's just, let's just go get that. I'm, I'm in the area. Oh. Hey, there's a Korok up on this top of this thing. Yeah, we did. There he is. Hello, Mr. Rock. I'm just gonna go ahead and hop on your back. Oopsie daisy. Whoop. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, your fire's not gonna do shit to me, bro. Don't even try. There we are. All done. Hey, dude, I got it. Need something? Beat the Ignis Talus. <laughs> what? You say you beat the Digni Igneous Dallas at Darunia Lake? Huh, I have no idea, but how about you sell me that achievement for a cool hundred rupees? <laughs> now! <laughs> sure! Yes, the deal is done. Here you go, brother. <laughs> Thanks! Thanks so much! Okay, what to tell Master about Igneous Digneous Dallas? Alright! Yeah, I did it! Oh, it's like, it's a cork around here somewhere. It, it's inside of his mouth, I think, isn't it? We. Uh, uh. Ah, yep, look at that. Ah, what am I doing here, dude? Ah, it's slimy in here! Have a Korok seed! It's kinda gross, though. Alright. Only one Divine Beast thing remains. Let's head over to the Zora area. 
God, why is it gonna be so damn far away from the, where where the elephant is? Rivali's Gale is now ready. Wow. Damn, Rivali's Gale Plus really recharges fast. It's like, God, it must it must finish in like two minutes at most, or a minute and a half. That's pretty cool. That's, That's right, because right. Rivali always, always finishes, finishes quickly. quickly. Wait, 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 that didn't come out right. right. Hey, Gas. All right, one more, man. Applaud your courage for coming here. I mean, you've done it three times already, but, you know, this one in particular is a real bitch. Okay. I think I know where that might be. I think so where the luminous stones are. That light. Is it a reaction to someone nearby? Is it me? Or is it... Oh. <laughs> it's me again. How the hell did I get over here? <laughs> well, when I stand over on that other side. Huh, fellow traveler, what brings you here? I suppose everyone has their own reasons for traveling. Look, I'm sure you already know, but it's one of the monuments mentioned in my teacher's unfinished song. I mean, it's the fourth time, so you should know by now. Ah, oh, sweet joy. How glorious to sing this song in the very land it describes. The song my, my teacher left behind. There's a verse about the trial... So that champion Mifa endured. Let me to sing it for you. All right. Tell me about my fishy wafu. Reaching skyward from waters blue. I'm sure there's gonna be rings in one of them. Rudus champion, a heart true. The hero's power shall grow. Seek trials, monuments show. One, find what light's path shows. Two, conquer the ancient foes. Three, chase rings of the waterfall. Yep! <laughs> Champion, the trials call. Always gotta have rings, right? So, did it move you? By understanding the true natures of the champions, I've closer than ever to completing those key verses. Although, you know, the more I think about it, the more that these these quote-unquote songs of my teacher really sound more like a grocery list of things to do. Remember to buy eggs on the way home and stop by the bakery for a cinnamon scone. I can feel it. my teacher surely sing this very verse from this very spot. Wish nothing more than to carry on my teacher's dream to complete and perform this special song. To do so, I must learn all there is to know about the champions of old. Thankfully, the Zora King and Prince shared memories of their champion with me. Yes! Prince Sidon! To sing the complete song into the sky that my teacher has so loved. That's the end goal of this long journey. You know, I wonder if this actually plays into your, uh, your side quest as well. Like, having to do this, uh, uh, the DLC. Because you guys said apparently you get something if you've gone through everything. And I, I think I probably have to talk to him back in, uh, Rito Village at that stable, right? Oh, I know exactly where that is. All those waterfalls! Right below where uh, the Lionel is. Yep, and that's, I believe, just to the north of the city. And this one is... Oh, hey! It's just to the west of those funny little islands. Which I still have yet to check out. I, I need to go do that sometime. Oh, shrine nearby. Oh, and there's Korok. Okay, the shrine seems to be down here. Oh, I see it. Right there. Some rocks I can blow up. I see you! Yeah, bomb arrows are, I think, are probably the best way to go with this. Boom! There we are. Can I Shikai Shrine? By the way, you guys said, uh, it, there's a possibility that the, uh, the names of the shrines are actually the names of the developers of the game, like, an but as anagrams. Ah, oh, that'd be pretty cool! Definitely, yeah, shy they were able to come up with so many different names. A modest test of strength. Okay. No problemo. Ah, man, let's do it. Spin! Ah! I'm coming! Booyah! Gotcha. Sapphire. Okay. I spy a smoke signal. We got out here. Hi, fellas. Oh. Hey, what are you doing all the way out here, man? Ah, it is you, Link. Brings you to this place. We are here at the behest of Prince Sadun, who has asked us with keeping watch on this area. This is land where Princess Mifa completed her sacred trial. Now, the signs that appeared a hundred years ago have returned. 
Princess Mephisnus had this phrase, when the morning sun is newly born, follow the path of light to the trial. Not sure where they came from, but she often repeated those mysterious words about the trial after another one of her drunken ragers. What? what? No! I didn't get drunk! I just like to party sometimes, okay? Get off my back, old man! Oh, Jesus! Well, well Mr. Bull, what, what did I do? Uh, even they were on guard, too. They're like, ah! Okay, so... Wait for morning? Oh, there it is. Wait, are these the rings? Find what the light's path shows. Ah, oh, yeah, the path of light right there on the... On the ocean. Okay, so I just fly all the way over to it? Don't mind me, Mr. Helicopter! How do I get back out? Uh... Oh! oh, that would hurt like hell. There we are. Oh, good. It's all the way out here as well. I was like, please don't make me have to swim all the way back to land. If that's the case, I'll just fucking drown myself. It's a little island shrine. Key de Funa Funia Shrine. The melting point. Okay, got a whole bunch of ice, but I'm not going to want to melt all of it though, right? Melt! It seems like it's going to be similar to the, the one with the the kind of broken blocks that you can destroy with bombs. You want to destroy some of them, but not all of them, right? Oh! Oh, I thank you! Oh, hey, whoa, alright. <laughs> it comes with its own little ice machine! Hey! <laughs> That's kind of funny. Okay, I can stay some, but I can't grab them with Magnesis. Uh, okay, we got a little ice machine here, too. Give me a Pepsi! Oh, can I can I cry on a season anyway? No? I like my ice cubes better. I can actually climb on those. Oh, I see. You gotta melt it some so I can climb on top of it. That's pretty clever. Like that. Okay, that's probably good enough. Oh, come on. I, I should be able to reset. There we are. Oh, but now what do I do? Also, if I stay on this block for too long, it's gonna... It's gonna start melting. Okay, here we are. The flame weapons will make this a bit easier. There we go. Oh, I can push it. I bet once it gets small enough, right? I'm gonna need to push one all the way over here. I think. Right, but where's that chest? Oh, there it is. It's underneath this. You get on out of here. Here we are. Frostblade. Kind of the opposite of what I want here. Just keep on melting it till I can actually start pushing it. Actually, I probably could stasis it. But I kind of forgot I could. There's that. There we are. And this will give me the extra oomph I need. With my combined with my cryonis to reach up there. There we are. Clever. All right, cool. Okay, Rooja's emblem. One down. Oh, here we go. Start from the bottom. Work my way up there. Here we go. Gotcha. Up again! And again! Er. Once more, with feeling! Er. Yeah. yeah! Come on! Come on! Woo! Woo! Uh. Yeah. All right, the My Elia Shrine, or Ma Ma Elia. Secret stairway. Okay, looks like we climb some waterfalls and we got some magnesis here. Oh, oh, oh! I gotta put it up there and then cryonis it, or stasis it, I guess. There's no way I'll be able to cry on it so fast enough, so I'm gonna have to see, just do it like that. There we go. Oh, here we are. Now, can I lift them both at the same time? 
I can. Okay, good. Uh, no, that's not quite right. It's like I see what I need to do. I need to use like stasis and cryonis to to get these up, but it's kind of hard to do that. Keep it up high enough to because it comes down so quickly. It's hard to. I, I don't think I can get a cryonis block out fast enough to stop it. So I have to stasis it, but again, that's also really difficult. Oh, I know. I, I gotta lift this up and then push that one underneath it. I think. If I can do that. Ow. This was kind of tricky. I, I don't know. I'm just being an idiot here, but it's like... Being able to actually get these things to stay up in the air long enough. Oh, 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 no. I I, I can cry on this from the floor, too. Don't forget that. There we go. That That's what I'm missing. Wait, I think. Uh, yeah, I just can't get that fast enough to... I don't know if I'm just like, do I just slowly move it up like this? Take this, move it up. I feel like I'm making this harder than it probably needs to be. I just, still not high enough. I need to be really fucking high on this. I think there's gotta be a better way than this way. Like trying to just quickly stay in place and then move this up like that. I have no idea. <laughs> but I think this will work, yeah. There we go, man. Oh, that was, that's it. Where's the chest though? You must go even, oh God. Oh, there it is, yeah, and uh, it's metal. Oh, I gotta get the other side to go up and down now. Well, seeing as that took the entire dungeon, like that was it, that, that literally is the whole dungeon. I imagine that, I think it is that complicated. <laughs> I'm hoping, I'm hoping not the only one to just like struggle a bit with that. Come on. Uh, it's just out of reach. Shit. There we are. Okay, quickly. Grab it. Ah. There we go. Royal shield. Okay. Get a lot of those now. Okay, that's two down. Oh, we got some guardian helicopters over here. So defeat the ancient enemy, so I guess I'm to shoot their ass down. These guys are fucking bitches to kill, so I'm I'm just gonna shoot them with freaking ancient arrows. How many are there? Okay, we got two. Oh no, and that thing too. Sorry, yeah, I can deal with you. Oh, three, what? Ah! Long distance parry. Ah, you're nothing. Okay, I do not want to miss with any of these arrows. I've only got ex I've got exactly three ancient arrows. Boom! Hey, you still drop parts. I thought they weren't supposed to drop parts. Or maybe that's probably for regular enemies, right? That's that's probably what it is. <laughs> yeah, so I actually I do actually have to aim for the eye to get a one-hit kill. So it's a good thing I did that when I was in the trial by sword. All right, just this motherfucker left. Motherfucker. Oh, no. No. Ah, yes, he never goes and hits him in the eye. That's the... Oh, God. Oh, it's raining. My bomb barrels aren't gonna go off. That's that's what the issue is. I was like, what is going on? Stun like the motherfucking shit out of you. There we are. Don't fall down the mountain. Gotcha. You know, actually, I'm so far I actually finding Mipha's side. Her trials actually be tougher than any of the other ones previously. Man, it's a good thing I did this one last. Like seriously, three fucking guard guardian coptus. And, oh my god, they're all fa falling down. Uh, and a turret? Support and guidance, the Sato Koda Shrine. Oh, looks like we're dealing with some more balls. They sure love these little ball mechanisms. By the way, I thought it was funny. I, I After I brought up that Connects thing last episode, I know I brought it up in the episode, but I actually went and looked it up to see, like, like oh, the Connects still around? Answer is yes, they are. And apparently they brought back, after 20 years, the ball factory that I had when I was a kid. 
I guess it had actually been gone up to this point. Wow, what are the <laughs> what are the odds of that, huh? Ah, uh, now you two can relish in my childhood. <laughs> it looks kind of like a giant pachinko machine. Uh, oh, there's a little button down there, isn't there? Oh, that's oh, that's the button I want the ball to hit. Oh wait, no, I can reach it from all the way over here. Okay, I I thought there was like a, a range to this cryonis, or well, maybe there is, but I don't have to be right next to it. Come on, buddy. There you go. Uh, okay. Should go down, hit that. Oh, I see. I gotta get it down there where it'll shoot it straight up in the air. I, I gotcha. Get the ball down to the launcher. Okay, I'm gonna need four for this, so let's go ahead and set it right there. And... Yes! Now, fly ball! And right in the hole. Yeah, that's cool. All right, final one. Give it to me. Now return to your big elephant friend. All right, Mr. Elephant. Let's do this shit. All right, let's. I'm going into my brain. Arrgh! And imagine I'll be wearing the full Zora outfit. Yep. Oh, looks like I got a... Oh, is it the ceremonial trident or light scale trident? All right. Shut up. Shut up and let me fight him. Water Blight Ganon. Okay, what do I got? Got a silver bow, only 10 arrows, really? Okay. Oh, I do. I have the light scale trident and two ceremonial tridents. Oh, yeah. I'm going to me for this shit, baby. Hell yeah, yeah girlfriend. Girl Let's do this. All right. Oh, God. Oh! Okay, baby, not like that. Ah, oh, eat lightning! Oh, wow, I did a lot of damage. Go ahead. Go ahead and frost up the place. Fill it with water. <laughs> Remember last time I did this, I, I used uh, Cryonis to make platforms to... Uh, Get up to him, but I probably just shoot him in the face, right? Reach him. Oh, yeah, like that. I don't have a whole lot of arrows though, so try not to miss. There we go. Yep, three. Oh no, the lightning! Oh, he was fucking teleporting. Such an idiot. Gotcha. Oh no, he went in the water. God damn it! Oh wait, no, I get, I get in with my, my torpedo attack. Oh, come on, get out of the water. Get out of the water, like you idiot! <laughs> Size Link does not want to get out of deep water areas. He just wants to sit there and soak it all in. And I've only got one arrow left, which is not enough to get him down here, so. Ah, oh, there we go. How about a taste of Arbosa's Fury then? There we are. I guess. Oh. Are you still adrift in thought? You seem lost to the whims of your mind. Oh, pardon me. It's supposed to sound my business. Just battling Ganon bosses in my brain. Well, okay then. Ah, wandering around here and listening to the anecdotes about Champion Mifa has truly invigorated me. Mm. In fact, it has inspired me to honor her in my own way, except for my teacher's unfinished song. That's why I felt inclined to roost here, near the Divine Beast Vah Ruta, which Mifa herself mastered. Mm. I've written a song to try and capture the essence of Champion Mifa. Oh, good. We'll call the champion of Ruta's wrath. Before she walked her chosen path. Mifa's kindness was known to all. Which is why the princess came to call. Oh my god, we're about to witness Mifa kick some monkey ass. Hell yeah! So, Princess, may I ask who the other chosen champions are? Goron Vigilance, Daruk. Rito Confidence, Rivali. Gerudo Spirit, Obosa. And also. 
The Hylian with the sword that seals the darkness. <gasps> Link. Oh. Oh my god, yes! Oh my god! Still too young to swim up this big waterfall. Oh my god, a little baby sighted! One day, princess, I must leave him. Oh, there it is. To face my fate with Ruta. Promo art pose! Oh, here she goes! I'll show you what the real best weapon is! Yeah! Oh my god! We'll go together so you can get a feel for it. We shall go together! Let's go. Oh my god, look at his little chubby cheeks! <laughs> I'm flying! I'm babysitting! Yeah! <laughs> oh my god. Best Oni son ever! Sweet Sidon, should fate ever part us, I'm counting on you to protect our beloved home from harm. Understood? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I believe in you. Now, shall we try one more time? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, I want them both! I want them both in plushy form, it's so cute! Fuck! Stop it! Ah! Ah mm, I think Nico just had a cute gasm. Hmm, though she was known for her kindness, it seems the Zora Princess could be quite strict when necessary. I thought we were gonna see her like stab someone with a spear, like ah! <laughs> The way, what came afterwards was the bloodiest battle ever. Just so, just so you understand, the color of my fins used to be blue. <laughs> oh, shit. So, what do you think of Champion Mifa's song? It was hot and adorable. Oh, my God. Ah, uh, little baby sided. God damn it. By writing a song that captures the termination of Champion Mifa, I feel closer than ever to my dear teacher. Oh. Missing verses of an ancient song. I think perfect. a perfect setting would be Hyrule Castle in the distant past. You're so strong. So much stronger than before. The power of Mipha's grace will now recharge much faster. Thank you, Mipha. As powerful as you are, I am certain you can save Hyrule. As well as the princess who awaits you. But forget that, that skank. skank. It's all about me, remember? Yay, alright. Hers is definitely one of the most useful ones. Oh, well, that's it. They're actually all pretty useful in their own way. Even Daruk's, which I didn't think would be all useful initially. Moskosia, I must commend you for conquering the trial thus far. So what I got? I got something else left. The door to the final trial is now open at the Shrine of Resurrection. Ooh, all right. Going back to where it all started. Go and face your fucking destiny. Okay. You don't, got, you don't have to show me where the Shrine of Resurrection is, all right? I, I've been around. Before that, we have to stop by Zora's Domain. All right, I, I, I could probably uh, uh, grind on the the bosses to see additional dialogue from Mipha. Unfortunately, I kind of used a lot of... A lot of what I did was with Urbosa's Fury. That was what did so much damage. And... I don't, does it re... It doesn't refresh every time I start the fight, does it? I, no, it didn't, because I remember I didn't have Mipha's grace for it, so... Yep, and it's already on cooldown, so... Mm, I don't know. I don't think that's going to be one I could easily... ...quickly do. Hey, Daddy Mipha! I came to check out and... ...read your daughter's personal diary! <laughs> oh, well, okay. Thank you, Link. You have saved us all. So that Mipha is thrilled to be with you, as she ever was. It's kind of hidden, Miss Daddy. She'll watch over Mipha's fight from here. And yours as well. If you need anything, I'm ever at your disposal. Tell me about Mipha. Yes, of course. You wish to hear about our dear Mipha. 
She would bring her peace to know she's on your mind. Sometimes. Mifa was always kind from the day she was born. She's equally as kind to her own as she was to complete strangers. <laughs> when you first took to, to visiting us back when you were but a child, she adored you like a brother. However, as you know, Alien's age much faster than us. Eventually you grew so much she began to look up to you. As Mifa's diary plainly states, it's not long before she developed strong feelings for you. <laughs> Azor princess falling in love with a Hylian swordsman. Reminds me of Azor legend of old. That's why I welcome the idea of Mifa becoming the uh, of you and Mifa becoming husband and wife. Husband and fishy girl. It's a shame that you two never had the chance to see what might have been. Mifa's diary, let me see that. Of course, Mifa's diary was found just recently. Discover brought me much joy. It's on the table over there. To remind if you choose to read it, I'm sure Mifa would forgive you anything. No, no, don't, don't do, do it! it. I'm, I'm just, just gonna, gonna go, go it. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> I, I want you to see all my dirty secrets. secrets. Hell yeah, girl. All right, let's do this. At the request of Hyrule's king, a group of outsiders came to greet us at the domain. One of them was a Hylian child of only about four years of age. His name was Link. He made quite a first impression. He was curious and full of energy, with a ready smile. All Hylian children that way. One thing that surely sets him apart is his swordsmanship, which I hear is exceptional. <laughs> at four years old? Damn. Even as best an adult. <laughs> oh my god, seriously! That was a diesel ass baby! He must be somewhat reckless, however, as he was covered in bruises. Wishing to be helpful, I healed his wounds for him. It must have been his first time seeing healing magic, as he looked up at me with big round eyes. It was adorable. Oh, you're so cute! I'm the vine beast was excavated from Zora's domain. This one is called Varuta. First time I laid eyes on Ruta, I was surprised by how cute it was. <laughs> it's so so big and round with a long awkward nose you're oh you're just a big adorable little elephant according to the shika who found ruta divine beasts require some one worthy to control them it's fun to imagine someone piloting this enormous beast in the distant past wonder who will have that honor next link came to visit the domain feels like forever since he was here last he no longer resembles the child i first met but a strapping young man with broad shoulders and a big old Flowing locks! Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. He's now an accomplished knight and keeper of the sword that seals the darkness. I'm so proud. However, he hardly speaks anymore and smiles even more rarely. He's still the kind soul I knew, but something has changed. Ah, uh, interesting. I asked him if something had happened, if something was wrong. He merely shook his head. Perhaps it is his newly acquired height, but I feel like he is ever looking past me. Into the distance beyond. No, oh, God damn it! That blonde bimbo is standing right behind me. God. Princess of Hyrule paid a special visit to the domain. She asked if I would agree to pilot a divine beast. She told me that she needs my help to face the calamity. My heart knew at once what to do. I agreed without reservation. Calamity again. It must not be resurrected. Fears there's no way to ensure the safety of my people or of anyone. And how am I supposed to fuck my boy toy with a big old pig running around? I do not know what will happen. All I know is that if there is anything I can do to help, I must try. I must protect Hyrule. There's also that the divine beasts are meant to assist the chosen hero when he faces Ganon. In this way, I can help Link. Link came to visit me. It had been ages. I told him the Lionel of Ploy Mismounted has been terrorizing everyone lately. So I went and smoked his ass. Oh, by the way, you guys told me apparently, uh, in regards to uh, Link and Zelda's names, so uh, apparently every princess is named Zelda. Uh, everyone like that Hyrule lineage. Or Hy Hylian, or Hyrule Hyrulean lineage. And for Link, I think you guys said it's actually a little, like, different. Because apparently in other games, you can actually name him something else. But in this game, he is actually called Link. Like, I guess, can can canically. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess I, I actually could have named... I can't. You can't actually name him something else on Link to the Past, can't you? I, I kind of forgot about that. I'm not sure about Twilight Princess, that was the same case, but... When I said that, he started walking toward the mountain without a word. Spellbound, I followed him there. What followed was the most bloody, horrific battle I'd have ever seen. I'd never seen Link be so savage. And I've never been more turned on by him! We were almost there. He told me to turn back. He insisted he would be found on his own. I stubbornly stayed. While I argued, the Lionel attacked us from behind. I'm sure he had, we had met our end. How silly of me to doubt. How fucking badass this guy is. With a sure hand and a fierce gleam in his eye, Link unsheathed the sword that seals the darkness and defeated our foe. The sword of the ship was swift and graceful. I was fascinated by the beauty of his movements. Though I should have been terrified, I could not help but feel safe in the presence of my dear friend. His kindness and determination to help those in need. His strength and skill. My heart is drawn to this. I am doomed. <laughs> the last beautiful move Link performed on the mountain is a... is called a spin attack. Perhaps I will attempt it with my spear. 
Father has finally given his blessing for me to pilot the Divine Beast. The threat of the Calamity no, can no longer be ignored. Father said the Zora must play their part. He seemed on the brick of tears when he made me promise to return unharmed. My eyes burned with tears as well, so I simply nodded. Second could hardly look at me. Muzu left partway through. I felt awful for putting them through this, but I must do what I can to help Link. I could never forgive myself otherwise. Speaking of Link, I have at last finished gathering the materials for the armor. I shall start making it once. Ah, uh, oh my god, she knew. She fucking knew for so long. It's like, I am gonna marry that little boy. You know, when he becomes an adult man. Today was the inauguration ceremony at Hyrule Castle. It was an honor to take part. However, I'll say I do not remember much about it, but only because something unforgivable happened afterward. Experience something wondrous. A beautiful moment in time I shall treasure forever. Made sweet, sexy love with Link. Oh my god, she said that. I will fucking freak out. I'm grateful to the princess for agreeing to my request, and to Daruk for, um, well, for bringing me closer to Link. Oh, I did hear something that shocked me enough to um. almost overshadow that happy moment. Wait, wait, wait. Link has been chosen to- Wait, what? Link has been chosen to guard the princess wherever he she goes. They shall be spending much time together. Uh, wait, wait! They were so vague there, what? I, did I misunderstand that? Uh, what? They're so vague here! Oh my god, what are they talking about? Through for- Um, well, bringing me closer to Link. A beautiful moment of time. She wasn't talking about the inauguration, though, since I wasn't listening to the inauguration ceremony. She said, a, a beautiful, wondrous moment that I will re treasure forever. Griffin the Prince for agreeing to my, my request. What? Oh, I probably request to bring Link there. And Daruk for, well, bringing me closer to Link. What? What? Did they do it? Oh my god, do we have a little half highly and half fishing baby out there somewhere? Here's something that shocked me enough to almost overshadow the happy moment. Uh, oh, she is actually getting real jealous here. Like, they should be spending much time together. <laughs> it was at that moment that I decided I had to let out Ganon. It was the only way to stop that slut from stealing my man. Oh my god, they really were suggesting. What, what happened? Do we make out? Do we fucking do it? Oh my god, no. I need some deets, man. Give me the deets. But it could be the special offer Link. I confident it will fit him perfectly. Cause let's just say I got a little up close and personal with learning his proportions. <laughs> if you know what I'm talking about, yeah! He's coming into the domain soon. Hope to give him my gift when I see him. But should I really go through with it? According to the old legend, long ago a Zora princess fell in love with a Hylian swordsman. Perhaps there is hope. Oh, really? What if that was in another one of the Legend of Zelda games? So it'll be a rare occasion that Link is not accompanying the princess. We should have time to ourselves. Oh, I have an idea. It's a shall ride upon Ruta with Link. Zora, princess of the past, please lend me your courage. Oh, Ah, oh, that's so cute. That's actually the end of it. No. That was actually the memory that uh, I had when I was sitting up there with her, right? When she was healing me, I think. Oh, my God. It was so fucking cute. Fuck. Ah. Let me check my... Oh, wow, that father and daughter memory is a lot further in than I realized. Um, uh, but yeah, that was kind of... I guess that was close. It still seemed like I had a little bit of time before Mount Lanayru and Return of Calamity Ganon. I was kind of surprised. Maybe it wasn't referring to this one. Aw, that's so cute. I don't know. It might, it might not be referring to Link, though. So uh, I know there's Zora falling in love with a Hylian princess. Or a uh, uh, swordsman. But I'm, I am going to just bet it's going to refer to like something in one of the previous games. Which, hey, I, maybe I'll check out someday, right? I, I mean, this I really feel like this Let's Play was so much better than I thought it would. I, and I, I'm really so, so happy because I've just been having so much fun with it. Um, and you guys have been just really supportive. And I really do appreciate that. Um, so, yeah, I think I would probably... I'd be totally down for checking out, you know... Some of the other classic games, you know, Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, Skyward Sword, uh, maybe Twilight Princess too. Uh, it's clear that I don't remember it <laughs> a whole lot about it, so. All right, that's all of them. In that case, let's go ahead and uh, head back to the Shrine of Resurrection. Give, give me back that uh, one hit, one hit obliterator. They were vague as fuck with that freaking, uh, they, they, they left us there. They did that to make us just like, like, what could they have done? They left that up to the fan artists, right? So many fan fictions. Bristol wishes to master a divine beast. You have done well to return to the place of beginnings. Now, get ready for a new game plus. You're gonna have to play through the whole game again. <laughs> Just to get to this final challenge. Damn it! Let me stow upon you one final trial. Oh, there it is. Turn the Seeker Slate to the terminal you first obtained it from. 
you do so, the final passageway will reveal itself. Okay, cool. <laughs> you ready for little Korak? Hey! Let's see this here. Can I... Has fulfilled its duty. It slumbers peacefully. Oh, bummer. Seriously, actually, I feel like I should be using this thing. To be Ganon. Although, I suppose the... I mean, he can kill me in a single hit, too, but... Hey, come on! It, it, it's whoever hits each other first, all right? And whoever wins gets to rule the world. All right, little Korak, you ready for this? I am ready! It's gonna be fun, crazy, dude! Place the Sheikah Slate in the pedestal. We are gonna update your firmware. Sheikah Slate confirmed. I'm gonna lock you back in here. Uh. Descending, please beware of tremors. Oh. Oh, of course. The Shrine of Resurrection is also just a big elevator! With a bath in it. Where are you taking me? Where am I at? Oh, still going. Whoa. Gumiri, may you've overcome many trials to reach me. Now it's time to face the final trial. Wow. Cool. Oh, see a little little guardian dude. Trial is a complex labyrinth. To start you will need a map. Whoa! Hey! Oh, hey, those little lanterns over there are like the one-hit obliterator. May obtain information from the Guidance Stone. Oh, okay. It's kind of playing out like a... A Divine Beast area, right? Ooh, we've got a nifty new tune, too. Oops. Alright, guys. Let's see what we're dealing with here. And I thought I was done with this little, this little tinkling eyeball. Okay. Oh, what? Wait. Divine Beast controls? Change rotation direction. Am I in another Divine Beast? Is there like a fifth one? Can't really tell what it would be. <laughs> Is it a piggy? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not trying to see like what animal it would be. It just kind of look like it. Maybe it could be a pig. Uh. Okay. Like. Okay. I'm choosing which direction to, to rotate the t rotate the cogs. Oh yeah. It looks like it stays rotating. Ha! Lift me up. Oh. I see something right there. Yeah, seriously, it's like. <laughs> Are these not, can I dual wield and one hit obliterators? <laughs> now that it would be overkill. All right, better equip my fire uh, breaker armor. Ah! Can't stop the rotation on this. Oh, 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 oh! I gotta go the other way. So turn this way, and na now I'm gonna cross this. I was like, <laughs> how am I supposed to do this? Just don't fall off again. Ah, go ahead and burn me. I don't give a shit. Ball. Uh. Oh, I see. Okay, wait for the shoot to get it. Oh, there it goes. Okay, now back the other way. I must guide it where I want it to go. Whee! Okay, and back again. Flip me over and pour me out. There it goes. Okay, back again. Come to me, little ball. There we are. Yeah, that was cool. Okay, where did I put you exactly? Oh, right here. There you go. So 
it's interesting if this really is another divine beast was this intended to be my divine beast maybe the divine beast of link the other champion okay one down deactivating one lock of the door Ooh, okay actually that would make me wonder that what 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 would i do can i use what get my own divine beast or something just roam the fucking landscape <laughs> that would be so tight Lay waste! Get my own fucking Megatron! Grab that chest over there. A cobble crusher? Seriously? Oh wow, with a whole 15 damage. Just look at that! No bonuses or anything! What the hell? I'm this far in the game, alright? I. I. You've gotta be an endgame by this point, alright? To be able to get here. Uh oh. Ah! Fuck you! Ah, dead! Boom! Boom! Oh, I got time, it's just right. Ah! Oh, yes! How about that? First try! Gerudo Shield. Am I getting, like, one of uh, everything from all these different races? I'm not getting very good equipment in here, though. It's kind of, kind of weird. Maybe there's just to symbolize stuff. I, I, I don't know. Oh, interesting. I, when I froze it, it actually froze the entire thing here. All the gear, All the gears froze. Which is supposed to make sense, you know? One gear stops, that they're all gonna stop. Okay, what we got going on here? Oh. Well, hello there, friend. Ah! Oh, I am. I'm getting a whole bunch of different stuff from the different races, but it's all the really, really weak shit. Come on, I don't know they all got good weapons, too. Some of that stuff. Oh, and I see. The other area where I got the Cobble Crusher was the quote-unquote Goron area, right? This is gonna be the Rito area. With the the wind and the windmills and stuff, and that's where I get the Rito bow. Got the fan. How do I get it moving? Oh, I have to stasis it. I think, I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. I have to come back here later or something, I'm not sure. Oh, that is it, there's like, yeah, there's some stuff that needs to be moved first in order to... Like this. Not going far enough. You come here, Mr. Chest. Something Zora related? Oh, no, bomb arrows. I'm sure I will come across that at some point, though. Uh... Oh. Oh, am I putting it in here? Okay, so put that there. Take this, put this here. Slide it in there. Yeah, there we go. And now. Wait for it to fit in the slot. Er. Oh, yeah, that's it. Now the room's powered on. <laughs> that was pretty cool, I gotta say. I got that chest when I did. Oh, wait, it's blowing me the other way. Oh, right, right. Gotta change the direction. Blow me forward! Oh, yeah! Okay, now turn the other way. Oh, don't suck me in! Okay, I'm here. Where, oh, I gotta get... Now I gotta get to the other side of this thing. So freeze for a second. There we are. Another lock on it. Deactivate it. <laughs> Do terminals remain. Oh, you're a tougher one. You get on out of here. Oh, I do have another thing here, though. Oh. Okay, we got like little, little turbines or something. Oh, I see. It's gotta stay there so it hits it. Yeah, there it goes. Just like that. Okay, now we got another little area here. It's the water area, so luckily, I find a chest still have Zora stuff in there. Oh, I gotta knock this thing upward, I think. Ah! Er, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. 
Cryonis. Lift it. Boom. Like that. Oh yeah. Now we gotta rotate. Nah, that's so cool. This, this is really clever. Puzzles in this area, are really, really clever. Honestly, the, the puzzles in this entire game have just been really impressive. It's how many different things they could build around just a, a core set of mechanics. Okay, that's where I need to go. Okay, we got this thing in my... Ah, rotating it a little bit. What am I doing here? Rotating it and... Am I trying to close it? Hey, maybe I'm going this way. Oh, there we go, yeah. Ah, yep, turn it off. Ah, and I got rid of the water, perfect. Okay, champion, or uh, Zora something, right? Zora Spree, yep. Fucking knew it. Oh, I see a metal ball. Pull the ball out. Put it back in. Oh, I see. Watch this, guys. Here we go. Ah, spin it back on again. And let the water rise. That is so cool. So cool. Okay. Three down. Only one remains. I wonder if there'll be a, some kind of Ganon form in here, too, then. You can't even know this place existed. Because I didn't. Oh, God, we got a fucking guardian helicopter here. Just leave me alone, dude. No. 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 Don't look at me. Ugh. Ah! Thank you. No, don't look at me. Ah, it's you too! Amber! Where do you guys keep coming from? Okay, move that to the side. Is that what I want to do? Oh, I see. I got to pull it through that little hole there. Uh, oh, come back. Like that. There we go. Okay, we need to pull this out and right here. No. I see. Now stick it in here. I think. Yes. Pull back and forward. No. No, go back. Ah, come on. Why is the neck getting in there? Gotta get it. the piston in there, don't I? Oh, no, 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 no. Just gotta touch it like that. Okay, wait for it. Yeah! Gotcha! The final one! Is he actually gonna give me the one-hit one hit obliterator? No. Okay, or another version of it? So it activate. Now I access the deepest area. Yes! Rudo Skimitar! I received all the types of different types of weapons from the different types of people. Alright. The way is open! Oh, this is where I gotta mess with this thing. Stick it in! The lock! Ugh. There we are. Behold! Congratulations! You get another spirit orb! Ah, fuck you! <laughs> oh my god! Hope this is work 
Worth fucking 20 bucks! <laughs> I'm kinda curious, did I get all the chests here? Oh, I didn't? Eh, yeah, whatever, these, ch these chests haven't been worth it, so fuck it. What you got for me? You have proven to possess the power of a true hero. Again. The name of the goddess of Hylia. Oh! Oh! Oh, shit! He's fucking standing up. Oh, am I gonna... F this file... Oh! I'm gonna battle one of these motherfuckers! Final trial. Oh shit, this it's getting real! Oh, that gave me goosebumps. <laughs> I actually see one of them move. Oh my god, here we go. <laughs> What's going on? What am I doing? I'm gonna battle you, old man! Fine, you wanna die that badly! Let us begin! Ah! Monk Maz Gosia! Come! Ah! Ah! Time to die, old man! Ah! Ah! Oh my god! Oh, he's wielding ninja weapons too. Uh, uh. Oh, he's doing. He's fucking shoot bowing. Like that, uh, Thunder Ganon did. Uh, uh. Uh, uh, uh. Come on. Where you at, bitch? Where are you at? Ah, fuck. Shit. Hey, it knocks me in the air. There we go. Got you in the eye, bitch! Ah! Again! Again! Ah! Ah! He's like, ow, ow! He's like, we're only just getting started. Oh god, multi-form! Here we go! Uh. 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 Oh, found ya! Gotcha! Uh. You get over here! Come on! Oh, you want some of this? Come on! Come on, hit me! Right here! Where is he? Oh, there he is. Uh. Right here. Uh, uh, go ahead, multi-form. I'm smack on the real one. Anyway. Uh, 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 come. Come on. I know you're right there. Come on, just hit him. There we go. Oh, man, me see me. Fuck, punk. <clears throat> now what you got? Oh, my God. Oh, he's getting big. I am now Uber Geezer. Ah! Fine, it's bigger they are, the part of that fucking fault. Ugh. Just a bigger target for me. Oh, oh, metal, metal. You do the same thing that old man did. Uh, the Yiga Clan guy. Ah. Here you go. Wait, can I hit you with it? 
Ah, boom, there. Yup, he is doing the exact same thing that you can play in it. Come on, come on. Yeah. Oh, what? You want some of this, bitch? You fucking want some of this? Dude, I've been doing that shit since you were fucking before you were fucking born. Oh God, Bigfoot! Ah, oh, your feet smell. It's fine. I don't give a shit. So much power! Ah, what the hell's happening? Ah! Oh, you just killed your own shadow clothes. Ah! Ah! Oh, my tootsies! No! Gotcha. Damn, that was awesome. Those little, little old monk dudes have some fucking skills, don't they? Oh my god, what's he doing? Peace out, bitch. Oh, wait, no, I'm still here. Face the ch challenge with great courage. And I thought I was pretty good, too. You have erased all doubt from my mind. You are a true hero of the DLC. As such, you are destined to take hold of this ancient masterpiece. Sweet! What am I getting? Ancient Obliterator? What the fuck is happening? Whoa, what is going on? You're not actually giving me the Divine Beast, alright? Because that'd be, I'd be totally fine with that. That'd be cool as hell. Is it? What? Oh, cool! Did I get my own UFO. What the hell? My own Megatron? What is? What is going on? What? What am I looking at right now? She gets later say that authenticated distilling rune. What? What is that? What? Master Cycle Zero? Insert materials into tank to convert them into fuel. You can freely call upon this item, but summoning it will not work in certain areas. What? What? Is it my, I'm not getting a motorcycle? Is that what this is? Master Cycle? It's pretty sweet, right? That which you have obtained is a masterpiece of innovation created for the one true hero. Hero of Hyrule, may the goddess smile upon you. Enjoy your new badass hog! Harley Davidson ain't got shit on this. I think, is that what, is that what it is? I can't, it says, you put it in there as fuel, it's going in a cycle. Oh my god. Oh my god. No way. Oh my god, there it is! Saw the picture on the loading screen! <gasps> what? What the fuck? Oh my god! It is a motorcycle. I just did a wheelie there. Cass! Cass, are you seeing this shit? Oh? Hmm? Ah, it's you. Oh. I can't put my feather on it, but I get the feeling you... You're even more accomplished than you were when we last met. 
happen to have the perfect song for someone as esteemed as you, I'd love to sing it for you. My teacher's unfinished song, the one I told you about. Oh. I finally completed the key verses. Mm. This lofty location is the perfect stage to sing this special song. It takes place 100 years ago at Hyrule Castle. Oh. Yes, the very castle you can still see over yonder. It's about the magnificent inauguration of the Chosen Champions. If you would please, would please listen to this special song, The Champion's Ballad. Ah. Turns out there was one other memory I didn't- I had totally forgotten about! Oh! Oh, yes! Are we gonna see what happened on that special day? With Mifa? Oh my god, am I gonna make sweet babies with her? Here we go! Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'm so ready. Yes, yes! Welcome, warriors. I'd like to thank you for joining me here today. And for your bravery in accepting this fateful task. Hey, look, guys, I'm still I alive! I appoint you Hyrule's champions and bestow upon you this sacred garb. That blue is a symbol of the royal family, one that has been passed down for countless generations. I didn't realize they had the Divine Beasts on each one, Those too. Those garments you now wear were all crafted by my daughter, Zelda. So if they don't fit, blame her. Zelda, I trust you with the task only a daughter of the royal family can fulfill. Lead our champions, princess. And together, protect our kingdom from the threat of Calamity Ganon. Those formal shindigs really take it out of me. I know, man. This is the Sheikah Slate, eh? It is. Apparently, there are more uses for it than we originally thought. Sadly, we've yet to decipher all of its secrets. 1080p my ass! The princess showed me something strange recently. Somehow it can create true-to-life images. Wow. I would love to see it. Um, Princess, may I ask a special favor of you? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, this spot should work nicely. Keep your eyes on the Sheikah Slate, everyone. Oh, I see. Daruk, can you crouch down a bit? You're as big as Death Mountain. Huh? Oh. What's with the glum face, princess? Give me a big smile. Oh, this is the moment she was referring to. Damn, I thought it was going to be some sweet making out. Ravali, move your tail closer to the group. Ugh, fine. <laughs> Mifa, you look so tense. Deep breaths, okay? Right. Hold on to me, girl. Come on, Mifa. <laughs> Stay just like that. Here we go. Smile. Click snap. Ah! <laughs> Aww, that's so sweet. I am a little disappointed. I thought, I thought, I thought something was gonna happen. Like Daruk was gonna like, like give me an opening or something. Like thanks for Daruk for helping. Like, like. Hey, you and Mifa should go talk about something. Like, he set me up, then I went in the corner, and we just, like, just started making out for, like, three hours. And, oh, man, that was so good! <laughs> I'll be like, ah! <laughs> I'd be over here just, like, peeing myself from excitement, like, ah! After ceremony, they would all forever be known as champions. I know, I was there. My teacher always advised me to write songs that transport the listener to the moment in, your, in time you're singing mm -hmm. of. Now, I finally feel I understand what he meant. And the true power of music. Mm. By the way, I found this when I was looking through my teacher's notes. I was thinking, 
You should be the one to keep mm. it. Your courageous heart reminds me of the indomitable spirit of the champions. I know you'll treasure it. Why don't I tell him who I am? Oh, picture of the champions. Ah, oh. picture of Zelda and the five champions taken after the inauguration ceremony in Hyrule Castle. Cass, Cass gives you this precious item after completing the champions bout. Oh, oh, oh! The teacher was probably the one that took the picture, right? But then, who was that? Which which one was it? Did we not get to see who they who they were? Oh, you're my little buddy, Cass. My final thought. May the souls of the champions who watch over Hyrule rest in peace. Link. Link. I have watched your journey. Every step. You have overcome every challenge with great courage. With the power that you have attained... I am certain you can defeat Calamity Ganon. Uh, still, I, I said that before, but I, I, I was just saying, you still can do it. True. Hit it, nudge, nudge, hurry up and save me! Oh my god! I did it, guys! I fucking did it. Mm -hmm. I dearly hope we meet again someday. As for the souls of the champions watching over Hyrule, may they finally rest in peace. Now, I don't think that was the end of your quest. I think we still... At least I don't think it was. Because it was it was all DLC related, so... Oh my god. Master Cycle Zero. Let's see this shit. Oh my god! What? Oh! Did you do it? Oh! Ah! Zero jump. Oh! Oh, I can jump on this thing? Oh, I can shoot my bow? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! Whoa! Ah! Ah! Oh my god. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what happened? Oh. Ah, what happened? <laughs> well, first for a second. That was weird. So I could put fuel in it, right? Serve so materials into the tank to convert them into fuel. I'm gonna run over this motherfucking Bogo Bloom with this shit. Here we go. You guys ready for this? Surprise, motherfucker! Uh, oh, there we go. Ha! Ah, I tapped you. Oh, oh, oh my god, it flew off at like fucking GTA 4. Oh my god, does it have a headlight? It does have a headlight! <laughs> Woo! Can I? Oh, I can wheelie! Yeah! Oh, it does have a fuel tank. I see in the bottom, in the bottom right there. I guess if it gets low, then I can fill it back up again. Uh oh! All right, guys, here I go. Uh, 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 oh yeah! Ain't nothing. Ain't fucking nothing. Woo! Woo! Doing a wheelie! <laughs> ah, bro! Horses, you obsolete, motherfucker! I'm coming for you, motherfucker! Get it! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, that's so awesome! That's the greatest day of my life! I'm riding a motorcycle, Legend of Zelda, guys! This is the greatest thing ever! <laughs> oh my god, this is so cool! This is so cool! This definitely goes, I think, quite a bit faster, too, than riding a horse. Oh my god, wow! Wow, getting around is gonna be a lot easier now. Oh man, so cool! Wow, this is a hell of a reward. This is not anything I expected. So I actually kind of did, in a way, get my own quote-unquote divine beast, didn't I? This is like my divine beast, the Master Cycle Zero. It's so fucking crazy. It's so ridiculous, but it's so awesome too. I don't give a shit how fucking nonsensical this might be. It's even got fuck. I just I love the fact it's got fucking. I got a headlight and tail lights. You know, it'd be really hilarious if actually when I when I would like swear like left or right or something, if I actually put a turn signal on. <laughs> that would be then it would be truly be the pinnacle of absurdity. I'm gonna say go say hi to that bridge dude. Hey there, check out what I can do. Woo! Yeah. 
He's like, oh my god, what the fuck was that? <laughs> oh yeah. What's up, boy? You like my new ride? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So shall we? What you doing? Do you not see this thing? Eh, I've seen better. Motherfucker. I bet you can't do this! Aha! Yeah, you can't do this with a horse, can you? Oh uh, yeah! Ah. Uh, this goes real it's really access my ancient gear. Fuck you. Boom! I want someone someone's gotta comment on this, right? If anyone comments, it's gotta be the people at the stable, so let's go check those guys out. I'm gonna hit this bird. Boom! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh yeah! It's your flamingo! Oh, there's a very uh obvious Korok. Which I probably was meant to get earlier. Better late than ever, right? You got it! That's another one. Oh. Got you, dude. It's actually gonna make it around a lot of fun. <laughs> I was like, just riding out my motherfucking motorcycle. I gotta go show this to one of the guys at the stable. <laughs> oh my god. Nighttime headlight, huh? Now I don't have to worry about seeing where I'm going. Watch this, guys. Boo! <laughs> Oh my kamikaze, don't give a shit! Ah, ha, ha. Yeah! I didn't even blow up my motorcycle, that's how diesel this thing is. This thing can go off road real well, too. Yo, what's up, puppies? You guys see this shit? You guys jelly? Yeah, I know you are. Check this out. I'd like to. Oh, Hi. damn it! No, I wanna register my. I wanna register my, my new horse. Oh no, I get off it! Damn it! I was really hoping they'd see it and they'd comment on it. I think it might be a. Oh, there, yeah, there is. There's a Korok on top of this thing. Can't believe I never noticed that till now. Guess I never equipped my Korok mask in this area. Got you, dude. Hey, girl, look what I can do! Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it! Ah, catch your Pura, you there? She would flip the shit out if she saw this thing. Come outside and see my freaking cool. My cool Wahog. Actually, you know what? I just kind of realized that little backpack on your back looks like it could almost be one of those new Nintendo Labo things. It is! I've sold my merch, bro! Yo, yo! Gotta pay them bills! I hear you, girl. Yeah. Kind of curious to see how many, uh... Maybe each thing I have left. How many pictures? Only nine enemies. 30 weapon pictures and 14... Wow, it's actually not that many. Fuck it. I'm buying them all. I don't give a shit. 900 rupees! And they get nice, give me nice high quality pictures too. Oh, didn't actually add all of them though. There's one right here I don't get, I didn't get. And a few here as well. Okay, so I actually can't get all of them. And it doesn't include the pictures of Ganon. I'll take all the Fauna pictures. Oh, other types, other types of horses? A giant horse? Giant horse is the last of its kind. Its physical capabilities completely overshadow those of regular horses, but its temperament is extremely wild. Only a trusted, skill, truly skilled rider can train or even catch this beast of a mount. It's a horse that chooses this rider. Oh, wow. Is it big? Is it like really big? It doesn't even tell me where it is. Based on the trees though, I think I have an idea of where that might be. The white, white horse. A ruling royal family that perished 100 years ago would sometimes ride atop white horses as a display of their divine right. This so horse may be descended of one of the ones ridden by royalty. And of course, the lord of the mountain. Oh, a honey vor bear. I, I came across the 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 winter kind, but not but not this one. Look how much nicer their pictures are than mine. <laughs> I say you can tell what it, all the really good pictures are the, the ones they took. Look at that. Look how picturesque that is. Got the little birdies and everything to pose. Yeah, I didn't think I took. A, I don't think I took a picture of a single one of these fucking birds, except this one, the wood pigeon. Oh, hey, what the hell are these? The cursed Bokoblin? Mouse has given these Bokoblin skulls a sort of life of their own. It must belong to any. Oh, oh, those things that fly around. I didn't realize that those were their own separate en enemies. The goopy stuff that they spit at enemies at you, like little floating heads. I didn't realize I could take pictures of those. All right, fuck it. I'm gonna buy the remainder of these fucking pictures. Give it to me. Would you like to buy one, dude? I got them all. Huh? 
Thought I could still add a picture, but it looks like I can't right now. Filling some options, they're still hidden. But I'm not sure what can be done to make them appear. Oh. Ah, damn. I wonder if there's a thing if you if you fill it, manage to fill out your entire compendium. I kind of feel like there could be. Is that? Oh, ancient short sword. Yep. Believe it. The sword was made using an ancient power lost to modern age. This really appears only when drawn, and its cutting power surpasses metal swords. Yeah, that's the one you get from the other, the other tech lab. I didn't realize I didn't take it. I never took a picture of this one. Oh, there's one that's not been included. It seems like based off the, uh, the info here, there's one more Lionel that is I haven't come across yet. I guess there must be. Yeah, one. It, yeah, that must be it. It's just like one stronger Lionel that I haven't come across yet. Oh, holy shit! Look at that! It is! I went back to... Uh, there's this one... The one area in the north here. I see north that I knew about where there's like two Lionel. And you guys have told me how enemies do get progressively stronger as you as you uh, tackle more Divine Beasts. So I thought, well, I've gotten... I had gotten one last Divine Beast since I checked this. It is. There's another one. Oh my god, what is he? A silver Lionel. Damn, you've got to be fucking crazy. All right, before we end this episode, I'm going to go challenge that new fucking Lionel over there. Let's see if I have what it takes to defeat the strongest Lionel in the world. i tell you what I am going to do. I'm going to ram this motherfucker with my goddamn motorcycle. It's low on fuel, but it's all right. I don't need much. Here we go. It's been like the deer in the headlights, right? All right, come on, Come get me. Where you at? Oh! Ah -ha. You can do nothing to me on my cycle. Ha! Learn to aim, bitch! Ah! Ah! Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, that's enough of that. Ow! Come on! Uh, uh. Uh, ah, is, is he striking faster? Trying harder to dodge. Ah, come on, bitch! I'm right here. Ah, ah, got one swing. It's all it took. It's all a demon took. Here we go. Ready. Uh. That attack is pretty much a pretty flurry around for me. Ah! I sw oh my god! So much damage! I swear he's attacking faster. It's like it's hard to, to dodge all of his attacks. Come on, boy! Uh! Oh, here we go! I don't think I've ever gotten a flurry rush on that, as that attack before. Ah! Oh god! I hurt so bad! Here we go! Uh, eat this shit, bitch! Boom! Oh, yeah! Get you with that crit. Yeah, he seems to drop the same stuff, though. Savage Lionel stuff. I think there's another one around here that has, like, maybe a better bow. Damn, it's a strong Lionel shield. Look at that. Yes, I am the strongest Lionel in all the land! Ah! Whee! Oh, I hit the chicken! Yo, what up? I hit big up my girl Pia. We'd go out and party. Girl, where you at? Ah, oh god, Master Lake! Where did you get that girl motorbike? Oh my god! It don't matter where I got it. Get on! Go back to my place and make it the dirty. Okay, what did you say, Master Lake? I'll make the dirty with you. It's impossible to say no to someone who's such a badass hog. Damn right, girl. Oh, donuts! <laughs> oh my god, it's so ridiculous. I love this shit. Ah. Uh, all right, guys. Well, I believe with this, <laughs> I am now done with uh, both uh, the main story stuff as well as all the DLC, which leaves just uh, getting the remainder of the shrines as well as uh, also uh, I'd like to try to maybe get uh, uh, most, if not all, of the uh, the side quests as well. You know, to say I truly did everything, and uh, from there, uh, then we'll head off and fight Ganon, save the world. But anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite. It really does help me out. And subscribe if you're not ready. Go pick a big one. Woo!
Oh, the SLP! Where the days are always sunny, and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time, stay classy!